In archaeology, GPR is used when further information is needed to help refine the parameters of a site. For example, GPR can assist in locating a buried structure identified through historical mapping or locate unmarked graves. GPR can also be used to produce a more localized survey across discrete features of a site to get a better idea of their size, depth and other additional information prior to excavation. The, the GPR would, would almost always um, be a viable instrument uh, to help us understand an archaeological site. Uh, having uh, the little uh, a longer a longer wavelength or lower megahertz fr lower frequency also allows us to get deep enough for burials. So I do a heap of work in cemeteries, unmarked cemeteries, unmarked burials within marked cemeteries, or trying to delineate the boundaries of cemeteries, especially out in rural areas. Mm -hmm.